What, what we're hoping to do kind of continuing with the march going forward is, um, is actually tied in a little bit to what you're talking about, which is that there is, there's these, a lot of misconceptions about science and there's a lot of barriers between scientists and kind of their communities. There's not a lot of, of dialogue. Science is mostly talked about like with other scientists and in, in kind of conferences and in journal articles. And so we really want to break down those barriers and get scientists into schools and have them talk with students and, and engage them in science and motivate them to be involved. Mm -hmm. And then through that, tie connections to policy. So you know, talk with them about why research is important. There's this sense that all scientists are like, in labs kind of dealing with pipettes. And in reality, there's a lot of other stuff that science does. And yeah. we need to kind of make that clear and also make clear that kind of the seemingly boring things like working with, you know, like little cells or whatever is what leads to the big discoveries that all of us think are so awesome. Mm -hmm. And that science is part of everything. And so I think breaking down those barriers and doing it is mm -hmm. something that I'm personally really excited about. And so what I want to do going forward is work with the March and all of these supporters and the partners involved mm -hmm. and kind of pushing that forward and breaking down those barriers. Well, that's fantastic. And, and actually, one of the things I'll add to that, why this is so important, is because 80% of the fastest growing jobs require math or science skills. And at the rate that we're currently going at, we're not producing enough people with degrees or skills in the STEM field. So it's so important that you yeah. all are continuing this work to try to push for and also demystifying what are these careers and what sort of the, the, the training that you need to go into these fields. This, so thank you for that. Yeah, there's this misconception that science um, um, like destroys jobs when in reality it's right. actually generating jobs right. and is important for the future. So I think it's really important to draw those connections. <laughs>